$8,400 is the quote. There ain't no way that's happening. I wanna thank Friday Parts for this care package. I've been a long time customer of Friday Parts, so I was happy when they reached out to me and offered me some help on my project. The next thing we're gonna do is loosen the track. You can see in here that when all this happened, it broke this other bogey wheel, so you can pull that out too. Here you can now get a really good look. It's broke. See these tabs? I'm removing the rear axle now. So my plan for this is I'm gonna actually remove everything all at once. It's just two pivot points. And once it's on the ground, since it's already broken apart, I figure I'll bolt the new frame up to it and then connect all the bogey wheels and axles. So this is prime time to get back behind here and really clean everything up. Now what I can't figure out is why this is a different part number from the other side. Because this definitely looks to me like you could switch this either direction. See, all you would do is just turn it to the other side. Why would why would that be any different? All of these all of these are exactly the same. So explain to me people why we are freaking on. Look at this. Hell yeah. That wasn't that hard at all. Pump it out here. Go. We have a completed, put back together machine. And this is about six months later, and I'm happy to say I have about 200 more hours on this track. We managed to save over $6,000. It wasn't overly difficult. With the parts being so large, it was very obvious what needed to happen. Uh, I don't have a ton of experience working on heavy machinery, uh, so it was a good learning experience, and mostly just happy to save money. Friday, hops, fix it once, fix it right.